Google Chrome is a fantastic web browser, but there are times when it crashes, freezes, or simply stops responding. There are a lot of reasons these behaviors can occur, so it's important to be very methodical when you troubleshoot and try to fix the problem. Let's walk you through the typical fixes that resolve this issue, from the most common to more complex ones. The first thing you should check before you worry about troubleshooting Chrome is whether your internet connection is down. In Windows, select the Start menu, type Network Status, and select the Network Status System setting. Make sure the current network status is, you're connected to the internet. If the status doesn't say this, you'll need to work on troubleshooting your internet connection before moving on to Chrome itself. If the status does say this, you'll also want to test the internet connection with a different browser, just to make sure the issue is only with Chrome. If you can't connect from other browsers as well, then you know there's still some sort of problem with the connection itself. However, if the other browser connects fine, then you know the issue is only with Chrome and you can continue with your troubleshooting. One of the most common reasons Chrome stops responding is because the tabs you've closed over time never actually close the process. Over time, these Chrome processes add up and consume all of your RAM. Eventually, Chrome stops responding entirely. This can cause crashing, freezing, or Chrome may not open at all. To see if this is the case, right-click the taskbar and choose Task Manager. In the Processes tab, you'll see all of the Chrome processes that are currently running. Right-click on the top-level Google Chrome process. That's the one with the number next to it and then select End Task. This will close all running Chrome processes, free up RAM, and allow you to relaunch Chrome. Another common issue that causes Chrome to crash or freeze are malicious or poorly designed extensions. When this happens, it's difficult to know which extension is causing the issue. The easiest solution is to disable all the extensions and then enable them one at a time until the problem comes back. Launch Chrome. In the URL field, type chrome colon forward slash forward slash extensions forward slash and then press Enter. This will open the extensions page. Now disable all active extensions. Once they are all disabled, restart Chrome. Again, in the URL field, type chrome colon slash slash extension slash and press enter. Now, one at a time, enable each extension and restart Chrome. If all else fails, you can reset Chrome to its original settings. This can help because there are times when tweaking the wrong setting can eventually cause issues with Chrome in the long run, especially if you're enabling beta features. You can fix all of these problems by resetting Chrome. Launch Chrome and then open Settings. Scroll down and click Advanced to open all settings. Scroll down to the Reset and Cleanup section and then click Restore Settings to the original defaults. This will open a window with a warning that all Chrome settings will be reset. Just select Reset Settings to continue. Keep in mind that this will disable all of your extensions, clear temporary data and wipe out all of your cookies. However, it won't clear your bookmarks, history and save passwords. Hopefully, these fixes will resolve your problems with Chrome. But if not, there are even more tips in the article linked in the description below. See you next time.